please forgive me if my English is a bit jittery or nervous in this video as this is my second video on this channel and I am still trying to catch on to the fact that you have to get used to being in front of the camera as I am camera shy. Thank you. What's going on gamers? My name is Mac Plays and welcome to a brand new YouTube channel. So today I will be doing a video that I had promised you guys in my last video which was how I got my name Mac Plays as a YouTube channel. Shout out to you if you go to school with me because you will be a major help or a major example in this channel if you did this from since since six since sixth grade. See, this is how it all began. Back in sixth grade, I still and always will have the name Mac at the beginning of my name. And yes, my favorite fast food restaurant is McDonald's. So you might guess where that came from, Mac. Donald's. Mm -hmm. So, if you were one of my friends as of Abby or Bree, we could just use that as a short version of their name, you were my best friend. And I just wanted you to know, thank you for that, because you are giving me where I am today, which is starting a brand new channel and uh, in a brand new environment. So, I got the name Plays because I'll obviously just be playing games. I decided to put a Z at the end and not a apostrophe S or a regular S because most of my favorite YouTubers use a Z instead of a apostrophe S or a regular S, because it's more common. So that's technically how I got the name, and I just want to speak further into that and to get more in-depth in that, because I feel as if more people will be asking that in my Q&A than other questions they would be wanting me to, to answer, other, as in, what are my intentions for YouTube, like I explained in my last video, or any other question that they missed in the last video, or anything they wanted me to know in the last video. So I know it's a bit early in the video to be talking about this, but don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell because I will, and I mean will, be doing the, at 500 subscribers, I will be doing the gaming setup tour on TikTok, which I will leave in the description. And I will be also doing a Q&A, a Q&A &A at 1K subscribers. So please don't, do not, do not forget to let me know what ideas you want to see in the future. Do that. Do not forget, don't forget to put a hashtag Q&A at the beginning of your question. You're about to ask me if you have a question for me to answer when we get to the process of the q and I always, I always and will always want to have different channels as in animations where I will be telling stories of my life through animated videos and vlogging when I get a bit older and able to show my own experience of life is, uh, other than living under the roof of my mother. So yes, I will be having other channels coming once I hit other big, bigger subs. When I get up there to like the big YouTubers, not as in like Facebook type or unspeakable games type. I mean as in like my own quantity. Like I'll be making my animation time story at 25k subscribers. This is not going to be a big 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 channel or I'm not well I'm not expecting it to be one but I do have big hopes in my channel and hope this goes so that's all I want to say before I went any farther into the video so we all know that McDonald's have those nice juicy burgers right yes we do with those buns that they have those buns break but the ones in the commercials they're thick and I wish they had those as the Big Mac but they don't the bread is like this <laughs> No, hey, I love McDonald's food. Like I said at the beginning, my favorite fast food restaurant to go to when I just need a quick bite. So, yes, that was my favorite. And as you can see, my hair. My hair could be considered as a McDonald's bun, if you think about it. Because when it's all laid and it's just left there, it becomes flat. But when it's out there and out in the open, it, it's, it's, it's out there because it's for more people to see. It's like this. It's like a... Not a heart, but uh, uh, like it's not an oval, like a sideways oval. Like, the, like how the Burger King and McDonald's and one is be doing their patties or whatever. Or, or even like Crystals. Yes, if Crystals put their buns on McDonald's, I felt like it would be good because it would actually make it look like the commercial. Sorry if I'm not moving around. I'm sorry if I am moving around a lot because I am trying to get comfortable in this environment. So, yes. That's technically how I got the name, and I just went on with my plays. But please let me know what games you all want to see at the end of the video. Coming at the end of the video, what games you all want to see, so I can know what kind of gaming content you all want to see. And don't remember, and remember, if you do have anything you want to know about me, 
Put hashtag Q&A and I'll answer it. it one case was good sub when I do the last, well, not when I do the last video, but when I get 100k and I do the Q&A. Sorry if, if my speech seems a bit jittery. I am nervous a lot and I'm not one of those YouTubers who is afraid to admit that in front of thousands of people on this platform. We all love and call YouTube. And I will be doing gaming videos starting Friday, this Friday, if I am prepared. I will be prepared as I, I just had got GTA 5 mobs today and it will be actually fun because I tested them out earlier before I started this video. So yes, respect those Friday. All my videos will be up to 15 minutes long. The only ones that won't be 15 minutes long is my GTA Online skits. Those will be 30 minutes long. So please make sure you watch the whole video. And make sure you leave a like and tell anybody else who knows about me. Tell anybody who don't know about me, know me. Because as I've discovered since today, a lot of people like my content. And that would make me nervous to post another video today. Because I didn't know if many people would like my content. So now that I know that other people actually enjoy watching me and want me to succeed, I am more comfortable making videos, as I would like to say. I'm just trying to get used to the point of being in front of a camera. And talking like an actual professional in the interview. Because I want the, my YouTube career to go farther into life, into my life and and, and go in deeper into what I am. Because I would like to get more personal with you guys when I get up there and I have more people to actually communicate with. As this is a positive platform and a positive community and a positive channel for me to grow and talk to you guys and open up to. I know this video is more than how I got my name, but the only reason that I have my name was because of, of my friends, my best friends, they <laughs> they made fun of me, and I and it, I didn't care, because all, we all made fun of each other back then, like how I used to say that Brie had some big glasses and Abigail just had a lot of red hair. <laughs> I don't know why it, I, I'm not that good at checking, because I am the type who don't physically talk about others as much as I used to do when I was in elementary school. In elementary school, it wasn't bad, but because hmm. I'm just trying to grow this platform. I already have up to six subscribers now, last time I checked, and it was a great start knowing that other people like my video because I saw, I saw great comments and great things in the comment section that was like positive to keep me going and to keep me liking the video. I'm sorry if, uh, if I'm like going through the edit because my last video I saw that the the green screen was messing up and it was like trying to force its way through me and it was like I don't want to say glitching but you know how like how it was in Rick and Ralph when the girl kept glitching like that it was like you could see through it like that or like in Benny and the Ink Machine when it's an old film and it's um <laughs> but yes so. Thank you guys for watching the video. That's all I have to say this video. I know it's a bit more than what I said. And remember, spread positivity no matter what you do. And no matter how you do it, just make sure it's a positive way. Please like, share, and subscribe. And please like, share, and subscribe. Turn on the post notifications. And make sure you spread the word of me doing the, the Q&A. Because I feel as if most YouTubers do not do Q&As. At the beginning, because they don't, they don't necessarily know what their viewers think of them. But I want to know. I'll also be reading the comments too in my Q and A because I want to know what you guys think about me and what should I improve. So please leave what should I improve behind your Q and A and what should I need to do or stop doing in the video that make that will make you guys more comfortable and more open in my community because I want this to be a a positive channel where I feel where you guys can come and be open and don't forget to do what i just told you and remember 500 subs we're doing q a not q a a gaming room setup on tiktok which will be down in the description also subscribe to my best friend channel please because he is a growing youtuber just like me he has been doing it for a few months now only have nine subscribers and i'm almost up there with him so i already have six and isn't i feel like since he did more than me that i shouldn't be ahead of him before he is of me i want him to be ahead of me because he has been doing more videos than me, which I am not, which I am not scared to say, or ashamed to say. So don't forget, subscribe to me, subscribe to him. 500 subs doing the game room setup on TikTok, and the subscription at 1K doing the game room setup 
Please like and subscribe. Bye.